The topic is the Science Times, September 16th, 2008, in which David Goldstein, a professor at Duke University, uh, challenges the value and whether any meaningful steps uh, forward have come from the genome-wide association studies. His contention is that the cumulative knowledge of genomic variants uh, with any of the diseases that, that have been approached is very small and that uh, essentially this has been uh, a lot of statistical uh, noise, uh, if you will, uh, perhaps not in those terms. And I beg to differ and would like to uh, uh, see what you think uh, on the website. Firstly, uh, the number of diseases that have been approached by genome-wide association studies is now well over 40, now even approaching 50. And these are replicated by multiple independent studies in large cohorts and have actually uh, now uh, uh, provided the underpinnings, the biologic basis, the key pathways of so many different important diseases. So for example, to know that complement factor H and B have come out from the first um, uh, genome-wide association study of macular degeneration has led to a clinical trial uh, blocking complement factor to see whether that can block the progression of this important, most um, important cause of blindness. Similarly, now we understand critical pathways of Crohn's disease uh, invoking autophagy and uh, aspects of diabetes mellitus at the molecular subphenotype level we never would have uh, had uh, insight about. So to understand the biologic basis of diseases is, a, as I believe, a big step forward. We need to now go after these same loci and genes for rare variants that may also explain a considerable part of the genomic uh, variants uh, with respect to um, disease susceptibility or protection. But unquestionably, there has been uh, a great uh, uh, strides regarding uh, the, the knowledge gleaned from genome-wide association studies. And, and certainly, in my view at least, is that uh, Dr. Goldstein has minimized what others might consider extraordinary progress. In fact, science uh, 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 proclaimed it was the breakthrough of the year uh, at the end of 2007, and that breakthrough is continuing at breakneck pace. So I look forward very much to your comments on the Genomic Medicine uh, website. Thank you.